It's fucking cold out here. <laughs> Saying hi from Hong Kong. I just landed here from Bangkok. Yesterday it was my last night in Thailand. I said bye to Key Swan. Went out, had a few beers, had some fun. Goodbyes are always uh, always hard, especially with Nuna. I'm leaving Thailand. I'll be back in maybe a month or two, maybe three max. Probably to live here permanently. Meanwhile, I'm in Hong Kong. My first time here. It's kind of cool. There's always some positive, right? I'm off to Vancouver International and then off to uh, Montreal, Canada, baby. It's fucking cold out here. <laughs> so, last day in Canada, stacking wood. I can't think of a more Canadian thing to do ever. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get this done and then uh, Hopefully we can have a beer. <laughs> no, he's not gonna have any beer. <laughs> All right, I am back and it's a big day for me because since I got back on November 18th, I've been actively selling 100% of all my possessions. Now, last year I did sell my house, so I'd already gotten rid of you know, the fridge and the stove and all that stuff, sold it with the house and I backed up a container, got rid of most of my junk that I didn't need, sold a lot of the, the stuff that uh, was still, you know, a value. Like I've been couchless for a month, so I'm basically sitting on the floor here. I live in my friend's basement and the rent is pretty cheap. So shout out to my man, uh, Pascal for that. And yeah, big day today, why? Because I'm letting go uh, something that's dear to me, and that would be my car. So I have a Infiniti uh, Q50S, and uh, yeah, it's a real beast. I love it, and I'm really sad to uh, part with it. All right, so this ain't Bangkok. Welcome to Canada, guys. And my mom lent me this thing. I'm used to driving things like this, and she lent me this. Beggars can't be choosers, but the ride from her house to uh, my house uh, yesterday in this thing was... Uh... God, I'm gonna miss this. <laughs> And there we have it folks, the car is gone. <laughs> Ciao man. <laughs> <Yes, sir. laughs> ah, breaks my heart, but I think she's in uh, good hands. All right guys, big day, it's time to move. Are you ready? He's not ready. Um, yeah, so I'll be basically down to that's gonna be like a duffel bag full of shit, my computer bag, uh, some luggage, all of this stuff is going to my mom's place. I don't have many things I'm gonna bring there, mostly, it's, it's mostly tools. So, and you know, collectibles, I have a collection of uh, NES and uh, uh, old Nintendos and stuff like that. So just stuff that I'm not gonna bring there, but I don't wanna sell, so. Uh, yeah, so Pascal. What up bitches? What's up boys? So Pascal said, get the fuck out. <laughs> it was about time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we rented a Home Depot truck. Gonna haul my tools back to my mom's and that'll be it. Last day in Canada, about to leave. You ready? No? <laughs> All right, I think he's nervous. We've got the Home Depot truck. All my stuff's in there. Gonna say bye to Milo. Milo. Bye bye. All right, off to Bangkok, baby. See you. All right, guys. So last night in Canada with my boy Pascal. So 
Cheers. Cheers. And uh, see you guys in Thailand. My boy. I'm going to throw you two Yeah, boy. And another one. And another one. Part two. So this time, uh, a bit too many things for uh, for just uh, a car. So we got the Home Depot truck. Pascal's gonna drive us to uh, to Yule. Someone's not happy. What's wrong, Mogoro? And that's when he knew his life was about to change. This is it, man. Take care. Yeah, also went up at all. Yes, sir. See you in Thailand, everybody. Cheers, Pascal. Thanks for everything. Bye, Cheers. Take care. Take care. Okay. See you at Charles. Appelle moi. What's this? Ciao. All right. You ready? I'm ready. Let's get the fuck out of here. Are you gonna make some friends? <laughs> yeah, good. Hello, hello. I'm gonna meet you. Oh, where's you? Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Three cats. Uh, that's it. See you in Thailand. <laughs> yeah. He's gonna get some air miles. Uh, yeah. Get uh, Thailand. Gonna do all. <laughs> Cheers, guys. I've got the drone, I've got the laptop, I've got perfume on me. The perfume bottles are usually problematic, so we'll see. All right, so finally made it through uh, security. That was the most awful experience I've had uh, in a while traveling. Um, you know, usually it's the perfume bottles, it's this, it's that, and you know, today was everything. You know, the drone, the computer, the, you know. Uh, all right, <laughs> sorry about that. Skip to the good part. This is gonna be my last uh, meal in Montreal. So, what better way to end, uh, you know, a journey in uh, Canada or Quebec by a nice poutine and a burger? I wasn't gonna do this, but let's do it. Cheers, baby. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, that hits the spot. I'm gonna miss that. All right, so that was a good dinner. Now, time to start boarding and uh, head off to Vancouver. So some bad news. Um, I'm gonna be delayed in Vancouver um, seven hours. So instead of arriving at uh, nine-ish and leaving at uh, 11, we're gonna be leaving at 6.30 a.m. Um, what really sucks about that is uh, the cat's gonna be stuck uh, nine extra hours in the cage with uh, little water and whatever food I was allowed to put there and no toilet, so um, no litter and uh, I'm gonna have to find something to do at nine hours in, the, in Vancouver, so yeah, check in later. Vancouver to Bangkok flight, which was supposed to be at 11 p.m was now delayed uh, until 6.30 a.m. So that means I'm stuck in this airport for nine hours. The Fairmont Hotel, which is uh, within the airport, is fully booked. And I was told that uh, even though there's a feeding schedule that they uh, make you fill out when you drop your pet off, um, they called me and said you have to come pick up your cat because we're not equipped to take care of them. So, um, yeah, Air Canada for you. Not a great start. All right, so the flight got delayed um, nine hours and I ended up sleeping on a bench with my cat. So we're on route and hopefully uh, 
I get there on time. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Made it to Thailand. We've got our grab driver, and I'm with <laughs> Nuna. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. And Mogoro. Mogoro. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, this is all the stuff I brought from Montreal, Canada. So, I've got many oversized baggage. Woo. Hello. <laughs> When we were kids in the backyard Playing astronauts and rock stars No one told us to stop it Called us unrealistic And suddenly you're 18 Go to college for your plan B What you want is too risky Live for weekends and whiskey We all got these big ideas One day there Placed with fear. How did we get here? Darling, don't quit your daydream. It's your life that you're making. It ain't big enough if it doesn't scare the hell out of you. If it makes you nervous, it's probably worth it. Why save it for sleep when you could be? Your day.